Burn fire and easily? I come to Las Venturas, a city with more love than it can handle. Love is realizing your calling. I say this, I once played music that brings passion, but I realize that you can have even more passion with a credit card. People in insurers only care about slot machines. Yes, maybe you pull the handle and win the backdoor passion. It is different with every woman. Some women need a self punch because they have been traumatized. Others have already been traumatized, so you freak them like a truck driver and steal a six pack on your way out. What are you talking about? I'm talking I might be about dressed passion. okay, but I still can mess you up for that. I teach you how to talk in just a second. You be quiet. Die at them. Goodbye, ladies and gentlemen. It is so good to teach you about love. San Andreas, you, in your car, touch yourself. I love you all. Christy, I will be out in fire. Wear something slinky but sophisticated and trashy. Your heart is no longer lonely. Fernando has been here. This was Lonely Hearts. Get out of here, you creep! Oh my god, is that Bush Cologne you're wearing? Yes, that is Bush Cologne. Do you like that? And do you like this? Oh. This is Fernando's signature move. Let me see that pipe. Oh, I love that. Let me see that dog, please. Give it to me for so a juicy. Mm. That was Lonely Hearts, only on WCTR. There's a gritty new show this season on Weasel, where the law is the drama, and the drama is the law. What the hell did you go to law school for? I haven't chased at all. I was always over competitive and shallow. I have a disabled brother I pretend doesn't exist. I only married you because you've got great guns. Law. Catch it Thursdays on Weasel before it catches you. And now, the number one show for vegetables on the radio, Gardening with Maurice. Okay, we are back in the garden. I'm Maurice, and we must answer nature's call. Going to the phones. Greetings, garden lover. What's your name? Hi, my name's Trish. Okay, is that short for Patricia? Uh, yeah. Not the nickname your skinhead boot wearing friends call you at the rallies. Maybe you should do less drugs and learn to try a bit harder. Next caller! Hi, my name is Colleen, and my husband has a tilt in your Ooh, this sounds serious. Well, he started off small scale, just recreational uses, you know, doing horses and cockroaches, the odd unicorn, but it's kind of gotten out of control. He just can't stop. I mean, people think it's all fun and games, but what happens when the party starts? What happens then? Oh, man, we gotta have some fun, Jack. Yes, I am. I've really come into my own in the past few months since I joined a cult and began tithing money in exchange for spiritual happiness and letting everyone take turns on my life. Anyway, I have a lovely garden, mostly carnivorous plants. A Venus flytrap reminds me of my mother. She's in prison now. Anyway, it's so fascinating how it catches animals and eats them. I started with flies, and now mine can swallow a whole squirrel or a small horse if I chop it in half first. Have you tried any experiments on human beings? 
Yeah, I've been working on that. Good man! Good man! See, the secret of nature is once something is at the height of beauty and potential, it is time for it to wither and die. A bit like the British Empire. Just look at that whole place withering and dying right before our... <laughs> it's run by a queen, and if she had a pistol, she'd be... But hell, I'm all over the place here. It's so easy to get out of control when you're doing something that comes natural. Line two, you're on gardening with Maurice. Yeah, my name is Perrin. Can I call you Telly Welly? Uh, sure, I, I guess. I'm growing flowers. Sometimes I get really angry, fly off the handle, commit herbicide. I don't mean to. I say, I didn't mean to.